It all starts with seismic survey in a designated area. In seismic survey, a low frequency pulse is sent in the water. The pulse travels through the seabed and penetrates very deep. The echo or the reflections of these pulses are recorded on the vessel. These echoes help in identifying various sediments and rock layers. This data is then interpreted for a possible reservoir of oil and gas. Once a possible identification is made, an exploratory drill rig is sent to site for further investigation. The rig drills down to the possible reservoir. If a discovery is made for oil and gas reservoir, the rig will then drill holes at multiple places surrounding the area. All this drilling data is sent back to operator base to ascertain commercial feasibility for developing the field. The very first step in developing a field is to carry out a detailed geophysical survey. In this survey, we collect data about seabed, that is depth, and what is on the seabed. We also collect shallow seismic data up to a depth of 50 to 60 meters below seabed and soil samples from up to a depth of 3 to 5 meters. We also do a borehole drilling to collect the data of various soil structure up to a depth of about 100 to 150 meters. Once this data is correlated, the engineering and design team will then make a decision regarding where to put the drilling platforms, processing platforms, how to connect these platforms with underwater pipelines and how to cost effectively bring the crude oil or gas in shore facility for further processing. We will then go and do something called a pre-construction survey. These are same survey as before but more targeted to some specific areas as per the design drawing for the upcoming offshore structures. Oceanographic and meteorological data is also collected during this engineering and pre-construction survey. This data includes wind and water current speed and direction, tide, wave height and wave period. All these data are very crucial for installation of offshore structure and their future stability. Don't forget to subscribe if you like these contents.